Hello YouTube, it's Doss Gregor, and I'm back from a few weeks of rest and relaxation. <sighs> At least I hope it was rest and relaxation. Might be the last time for a long time that I get any rest. I will have, I'm thinking about doing a non-descriptive channel update because I don't want to just go into a lot right here. But in the two weeks while I was gone, a lot has happened. A lot has changed, and so <clears throat> I'm not sure what's going to happen in the future, but we'll see and find out and go forward. And like I said, look for another video uh, coming out maybe after this one or tomorrow about me discussing a few things that is um, going on right now. But until then... This is a second impression of a review I did a while back. This is Netrunner. And I had someone recently, when I just got back, email me and ask if I would look at Netrunner 14 because it was just released, as you can see here, June 22nd. And I got back into town on June 21st. So I was like, hey, perfect timing. Let's go ahead and just go for that for this week because I didn't know what this week was going to be like. Netrunner is a simple Ubuntu slash Debian. And I hate to say Debian because Ubuntu really, it's not Debian. But it is based off of Kubuntu, which is the KDE version of Ubuntu. It had a, a very nice, simple install. Clean, crisp, easy to follow not very difficult at all and it came with some good utilities I've been using it for three or four days now haven't had very many issues there are a few bugs here and there there's always one or two that you have to worry about uh, but it does seem simple and complete if you like KDE if you're not afraid of what Ubuntu is doing out there uh, then this is a nice start to get into something that's Ubuntu based and works well at least so far that I can tell. Now they also have a rolling release version of this that if you look in their downloads area the rolling release is actually based off of Manyaro or Arch and it is right here where you can download it and I believe it talks about it somewhere what each is there it is the Manyaro Arch based version now the reason why I went with the Kubuntu version was it's what's really new right now. The other one is not, you know, as of April it looks like if that 04 is for April. And this fresh right out from the this very week. So let's try it out. Uh, Netrunner seems to have all the basics that you'd want to look at. They have some games here and some interesting ones too. Like Dunk Hunt is a internet based game that it sends you to. Frozen Bubbles always been a fun classic. Even uh, GL Tron is pretty cool and has some nifty stuff that's, uh, that's there. And of course your basic K games from KDE. It does sport GIMP which is always a very good image processing application and it has as its default internet browser the Firefox. Also you'll notice here that it comes with Skype already installed and I tested it just to see if it would start up. Everything appears to be good with Skype. There are a few special items here and there that are really kind of nice to have. I installed of course the GUVC view so that I can have my screen capture here and of course simple screen recorder it came with VLC I love it when a distribution comes with VLC VLC is an excellent application LibreOffice is its choice of office products if you require that and of course semantic and a few other things within the system settings now one thing I do want to say if someone says hey well doesn't Netrunner come with its own screen capture uh, software that it's thrown in there and yes they have and let me see if I can find that real quick there it is vocal screen I tried this and it either isn't compiled properly for Netrunner or for KDE there were 
bugs in it, very flaky. The sound was jittery. The screen capture was terrible. It was much better for me to go with GUVC View and, of course, Simple Screen Recorder, my favorite two applications to do my reviews about Linux on. Also, you'll notice in the system area that it came with Yaquake. I assume that's how you say it. That's a utility that I saw a while back that's very good to use. Uh, with that, you're able to attach a um, function key like F12, and it brings down, as you just saw, the console, which is very handy. You always need to go back to a console and do something here and there, and it's really nice to be able just to hit a quick button, pull up something, do something, hit it again, it's gone, out of the way. Wonderful. So Netrunner's been running well. The network connections had no problem seeing my wireless card and connecting through that. Everything else seems to run proper. I have tested various codecs and things like that and all of them so far have played without any issue. No issues going to YouTube and watching video, playing music. It did come as you noticed Clementine on there. All in all this has been running well and not too many issues other than an application here or there. This is kind of a short video mainly because my week has been difficult. A lot of things have changed for me at work and so that's why I'm probably going to put out another video soon to discuss those changes. I'm going to continue to try to do reviews when I can and tutorials if requests are made. I'm just not sure how often I'll be able to do that. In short, my company that I work for out here has downsized more of the staff and I have had to absorb a lot more duties within my organization which will require me to take on a lot more than I was doing before which is going to mean that there's going to be a lot less time for me and a lot more on my plate let's just put it that way so I'm not sure how things are going to work out. Now, that being said, if it's morning, evening, noon, or night, I'm sorry this is a short review. It's been a rough week for me. Hopefully more to come. Hopefully I can stick in there. Hopefully it doesn't kill me to try to keep doing these and continue to work. You know, you got to do what puts food on the table and allows for being able to do your hobbies such as Linux. Appreciate all the great support. Thank you much. As I said, if it's morning, evening, or night, whatever you're having, I hope it's good, enjoyable. We'll talk to y'all later. Bye, guys.